Today we're going to look into darker image number one. But we're only going to focus on the Death Blow short story, which is co-created by Brandon Choi and Jim Lee, with Lee and Choi on the story, and Lee with the art. A lone riverboat captain navigates the waters of the jungle while his mysterious passenger preps down below. That man is Deathblow, and he appears to be prepping for a mission. The riverboat captain goes down below to check on his passenger, but unfortunately for him, Deathblow feels his big mouth will jeopardize the mission. So Deathblow decides to do what he's best at. Meanwhile in Washington, John Lynch is giving a debriefing about how Deathblow has gone rogue. The man's name is Lieutenant Conrad, and Lynch mentions that he and Deathblow served on SEAL Team 7. He's also informed that Deathblow recently found out he has terminal cancer and they wonder if this is part of the reason he's gone rogue. Because it appears that Deathblow's target is a well-known drug lord that the American government cannot allow to be killed because of his political importance. So as Conrad heads out with a team to intercept Deathblow, back in Washington, John Lynch and security czar Craven discuss the necessity of this mission. Craven reminds Lynch that as unpleasant as this is, it's part of their job. And there you have the Death Blow short story from Darker Image number one. This was one of those early image comics that was always infamous for me. I can't remember specifically if it was one of those image books that was severely late. But I do for sure remember always thinking, when is Darker Image number two going to come out? But of course, as an adult, I'm pretty sure that was never the plan. But as we know now, this is the first appearance of Deathblow, and it's also the first appearance of Miles Craven. And I found it interesting how John Lynch referred to it as SEAL Team 7 instead of just simply Team 7. But I think it's supposed to be the same thing. If it's not, somebody let me know in the comments below. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you do, be sure and hit like. And be sure and subscribe because I'm going to continue to hit all the older image stuff for Wildstorm. As well as some of the sporadic new stuff that comes out. Until then, we'll see you next time.